Hi, this week of our appetizer and cocktail pairing is still uh, keeping in the summer theme. We have diced watermelon, tossed, it was half a watermelon diced, tossed with four tablespoons of golden balsamic vinegar with one cup crumbled feta cheese. And as a garnish, I just kind of draped some fresh raspberries and put a little mint sprig in the middle. And that's why it looks so pretty. And it's so light and refreshing and delicious. And for the cocktail pairing, we're actually gonna use uh, Texas white wine as the base, but we're gonna actually do it as a martini style. And what I've done is made a delicious, simple syrup from my garden. I don't know if you can see this beautiful green stuff here with my uh, floral arrangement, but that came from my garden. It's actually lemongrass. And it did so well in this heat. It's just really thriving. So I use this also for my table setting, and I also use the stalks, and I cut them, crush them, and mix them in with my simple syrup. So to make an uh, infused simple syrup, you wanna take two cups of water, one cup sugar, bring to a boil, stir, and then when you turn the heat off, then you can add your fun herbs. So what I added, as I mentioned, was lemongrass and also three tablespoons of lavender, and that's what gave this, this pretty color. So let's go ahead and get into the cocktail mixture. So go ahead and just pour yourself, like you're pouring a glass of wine in your shaker. I'm doing two because I'm one's for my husband, Toby. And per glass, I'm gonna do, because this is very strong, it's sweet and very flavorful with the lemongrass and uh, uh, lavender, I'm only gonna do a half jigger per cup. So I could have actually done a jigger with this. But there you go. And I'm gonna shake that up. Doesn't need a lot of shaking because again, it's just wine and a little bit of the simple syrup. So I'm serving this up martini style. And since it does have that lemongrass and lavender flavoring in it to let people know that they're in for a floral punch, I went ahead and garnished this beautiful cocktail with some edible violets. And there you have it. Stay tuned for next week. I'm going to be in San Francisco, and I've definitely got a little trick up my sleeve. So have a great week. See you soon.